Welcome to another Keyshot 9 quick tip. In this video, I'll briefly explain how to set custom pivot points using existing parts in your model. This can add another level of customization to your still renders and animations by allowing you to manipulate parts or models based on a rotation point. For this quick tip, I'll be using a model of a case which will require an assigned pivot point to open as seen in the intro animation. In order to assign a custom pivot point, select the part or group of parts in the scene tree that you'd like to rotate. For this model, I have grouped the top and bottom housings of the case to make it easier to manipulate. Once your part or group of parts are selected, right click on that part in the scene tree and select Move in the drop down. The Move dialog box will appear in your real time view. The default pivot point is set to self, so we will select pick to allow us to set our own rotation point. Once selected, the pivot selection dialog box will appear. Now you can select a custom part or group in the tree or click on a specific part in the real time view. I will select one of the hinges in the real time view. Once selected, press OK in the pivot selection dialog box. In this example, I will keep the axis set to local. With the new pivot point set, you are now able to rotate the part or group of parts based on your custom pivot point. Press the green check mark to set in place. Once the pivot point is assigned, you will now be able to manipulate the part or group of parts for your animations or still renders. Thanks for watching this Keyshot 9 quick tip. Let us know your thoughts on this topic in the comments section below. If you found this video useful, give it a like and share it with your friends.